We're living in the time of grace. It is a time where God is gracious with everyone. It is the time now where you come to the almighty sovereign God, the awesome, the most, there is no one like him. The fearful God, you will come to him and he will treat you like a friend. He will treat you like his own child. He will treat you as the son and he is serving you. He will treat you with utmost care, with humility, with meekness, with mercifulness. He will treat you with love. And no matter what you have done, he will say, it's okay, as long as you just come back and repent. I will not remember nor remind you of your, of your dark past. When you come to me, I'll wipe away all your sins and all your ugliness and filthiness and all the dark spots in your past, I'll wipe them and I will never remember them on judgment day. In fact, I'll stand before my heavenly father and I'll say, Dad, I am proud of my son and of my daughter for they have made me proud, yet we are full of sins. He'll cover them all with his precious blood that he shed on Calvary. He is giving you his grace. It doesn't mean he's weak. No, because the time hasn't come to show his power. It's the time of grace. Once that time is over, no one will tell Jesus what to do. He will just do it straight away. Before the whole world blink their eyes, they will see the whole world turned upside down on their heads. He will burn the whole world and everything in it. He'll burn it. This is not Satan. This is not Freemason. This is not secret societies. This is the judgment of Jesus Christ. God is saying, now it is time to reap what you have planted from the beginning. You went against me, now is the time to reap all the produce of your evilness. I'll bring fire on you. Jesus will judge the world. So they can put whatever chips they want to put in people's heads or in people's arms. This is childish behavior. Blind people to the core. 